Your it's your boy Gruff here back with another video and today I got special video for you guys today we're gonna be checking out what is the best way to get um S Z or even Z plus equipments in 2021. Um I want to make this guy just because it's the new year and stuff like that. I know I made a video on it and I also want to give an update on it. I feel like um this video is gonna be an update and I feel like um I'm gonna be a lot better at explaining things and stuff like that. And uh without further ado, let's dive on in. So I want to show you guys how to get what is the best way to get like your chances of you getting the S, Z, or Z plus. Now, be, before I start, some some equipments are a lot harder to re, to like get a higher um, chance of getting a Z, Z plus, or S than others. So also take that into account. Some equipments are harder. I can't really show you guys which one is which, but there are some that has like their chances of getting a S, Z, or Z plus is harder than other ones. I kind of know this just because of the sense of me being familiar in the game being an og player and yeah let's dive in so i think the biggest thing you guys want to understand is for you to get the highest possibility of you getting sz and z plus comes with the first slot now i'm gonna tell you why i'm gonna tell you guys why so for the first slot you want to get the first slot to have a gold the little gold slot thing on the first slot or a red slot now the red slot is a lot better because it um it helps you it helps you because the red slot means it's, it's a lot closer to like the maximum you can get for that slot one while gold is also good it's not as close as um the red slot as you guys can see here the gold one right here is 11.7 from 13 percent but when it's the red slot that means it's, it's gonna be it's a lot rarer of a roll and that means that's a very 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 good one as you guys can see here this one is a 12.8 percent uh in the max of this is 13 so if you guys can get a red that's the best thing but if you can't get a red then settle with a go and now um, i'm gonna tell you why the first slide is very very important now um i'm gonna go i'm gonna get uh in depth with the erases and stuff like that but say if you want to re say like your first slide is very very terrible right say you have one where it's like two is like red slots on the first and second one i mean the second and third one but you're trying to get a the first slot to be a lot better well you can be like well I'm, i can like re-roll it i can like re-roll the thing right but as you guys can see here when you try to re remove a slot it only going to show the slot two and the slot three so that means you can't you can't remove the um the thing the slot in the first slot so that means that's why getting the first slot to a gold and red is going to really really help you guys out to for you to get a higher chance at getting a z or a z plus or even an s so that's why that's the reason why i stress try to form to get the first slot to be very very high and um like a very very gold or a red slot so um, that's it right there now the second thing i want to teach you i want to help you guys out is how to get erasers now you guys see in the top left corner next to my zenny you see a number that says 66 and the left of it is eraser slots now eraser slot what they do is basically they remove bad slots and it helps you re-roll so you can get a better um you can get a better what's the name a better roll on a certain slot that you don't want so for example on this one going full out i have a red i have a red on the first slot and i have a gold on the third slot now what's keeping me behind from getting this a z is the second slot because the second slot is very very low number as you guys see is very very close to the minimum number is six percent while this is 7.4 so what the remove slot does it gives you a chance at you getting a higher roll or even a lower roll and i'm show you guys how to do it so what you do is you do remove slot you click this you can use cc but i feel like you shouldn't really use cc just use erasers so you want to click erasers click this and what it does it, it removes that slot you see how my thing went to an a now it removed that slot and i can click and i can have another chance of re-rolling uh, re and upgrading it to see if i can get a z so then i go back and it re and remove that 7.4 and we're going to upgrade this again and see if we get a z or not so we're going to upgrade this and bam this went up to 10.10 .10 instead of 7.4 it's still at an s it's still um it still didn't make it to the uh, z tier and stuff like that but um that's what the erasers are for now the erasers how you get erasers is going to be very very important for you guys and there's there's a lot of ways of getting erasers now let me explain so you go to pvp you go to the battle rank as you guys see here if you hit certain battle ranks you get certain amount of erasers as you guys see here the higher you go the more erasers you get 
So if you go to Battle of Faith, you get five and plethora, uh, etc., etc. That's one way of getting your races right there. Another way of getting your races is if you go to the Platinum Coin Shop. Now, Platinum Coins are very, very hard to get. Um, sometimes they come out in missions like this right here. I'm going to show you guys right here. Um, missions like this provides Platinum Coins. So they're very, very rare to get. Um, they don't really come out a lot, but you can get, um, if you do get Platinum Coins, you can exchange your Platinum Coins for three slot removes right there. Another way of getting um, slot remover is right here is the Lazarus weekend. So what this thing is, is every weekend when it's Friday, no, I think it's Saturday, Sunday and Monday, you get three of these little um, tokens things. And once you get three of them every weekend, you can exchange them out for eat four slot removers right here. Or you can change them for anything else. That's that's one way of you getting slot removers. Another way of getting it is doing the dual coins. Uh, if you do co-op. You do call up, you get uh, a lot of these dual coins and stuff like that. You can go to other and you can exchange your dual coins from right here. And you can get dual coins right here. That's how that's another way of getting dual coins. Uh, another way is doing these adventures. They have adventures right here. And even right here, you can get um, slot removers there. Um, if you go to the guild, if you have a if you're in a guild, a guild uh, team and stuff like that, and you go to the exchange shop. You even have and you get like tokens and stuff you can exchange tokens for the slot removes over here as well um another way there's so many ways of getting slots i just want to cover it all in this video another way is for right here dual um rare metals rare metals you get these by completing missions and stories and stuff like that and you can exchange um your what's names for right here you can exchange um some rare metals for slot removes right here another way let me see uh, another way is ustr this comes out every two weeks if you complete them some of the rewards gives you um slot removers and stuff like that but you got to have it at a z you gotta um you gotta complete every mission for you to get the z uh for it to be z and stuff and then you'll be granted um slot removers but i only think is that rust four and five rust four and five only provides you with the erases right there and um yeah i think that's it for erasers so now we can go back to the video i just had to make that detour for you guys to know where you guys get erasers so um racer slots now um for you guys to like for you guys to um if say you you want an equipment right you want equipment but like you don't it's hard to get and stuff um a good way for you to get the equipment that you might be working for is to go to the equipment metal now the equipment metals has some equipments it doesn't have every equipment in a game and i feel like that's what they need to work on but this is where you can do um, um the best way for you to get a z plus z plus is i mean a red slot or a gold slot is to keep is like the mass like it's the mass what's the name just the mass form it so um you can just go here and you can like exchange um equipment metals so you can get so many like dupes of the same um equipment that you're working on and you want to keep on doing this until you farm up some gold ones and if you can get some red ones those are going to be very very key and stuff like that so um ways for you to get equipment medals now right now we're in a gold medal pvp showdown so every time you win you get pvp um equipment medals and stuff like that but not every time we're going to have a golden showdown so how you can get uh, equipment medals you can get equipment medals by hitting battle rank 50 every every two weeks and i believe pvp missions gives you battle um gives you um missions as well but they don't give you that much they don't give you that much every single time so there's actually another way of you doing this is to go to training battle now every time in training battle whether you lose or win you can get um you can get equipment medals for that and what i like to do is i like to lose on purpose i like to lose on purpose and i like to bring shallot and I like to do um, PvP with Shallot and just sit there and just click on uh, Shallot and just stand still and let my opponent kill him, kill him, so I can just get my hurt, get my five equipment medals and then leave. And, um, it takes a long time for you to grind up it, but it's really the it's the only way for you to grind as much as possible. As you guys can see, I'm just gonna try to hurry up and let my opponent kill me and stuff. But I believe if you win the training battle, uh, PvP battle, you get ten, but if you lose, you get five. So. I like to do is just lose on purpose because it's a lot quicker you can get more equipment um that way per hour so um i just bring shallot bring like a weak unit and then bam you get five right there 
and you can keep doing this on and on and on to get equipment medals for you for you to go to the equipment medals the equipment metal shop right here and you can exchange to some items in the game um also z metal stuff also has that but in order for you to get this you need to like have need to get like 14 star dupes and stuff for you to get coins there and then um also uh rust metals also has some equipments right here only one so um and i mean there's there's some ways to getting different equipments now um just check out the uh, equipment store i feel like the equipment matter like getting equipment metal is going to help you the most so uh, I kind of help you guys with that and that's going to really help you guys get to a um, a uh, S Z and Z plus now There is also one way for you guys to get um, how you guys can figure out what do you need? What criteria do you need for each equipment? So say if you needed an S or a Z or a Z plus you care so like what number do I need to hit per? Um, for a certain equipment for it to get Z and I'm gonna show you guys that it's called an equipment calculator and it's from legends.dbz.space and I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna uh, show you guys what I mean so I'm gonna catch you guys there okay so we're at the website called legends.dbz.space now this is a um, website where someone from the community kind of like helped the community out um, I think I showed you guys this on how to make my um, how to make thumbnails and stuff like that and they just and then like my equipment series like best units equipped and um yeah so i'm gonna show you guys the equipment calculator you go here and you go to equipment now um for the equipment i want to show which one i want to um i want to showcase the example of i want to show the one with kava um the one i was just showing um uh, which one how is it is this one right here so this is the equipment i'm looking at as you guys can see here it's the same one and um i'm gonna show you guys the equipment calculator and i'm gonna show you guys how you can see which units you need to assert i mean which um what's criteria you need for like a certain slot and stuff like that for you to get an s so as you guys see here this is the rank calculator um as you guys if you slide this here right here and um it shows b so um we're gonna show we're gonna like go and copy where we are at right now so you check here our strike defense is at 12.8 so we're gonna slide this to 12.8 and at slot three ours is at 4.8 so we're gonna slide this to 4.8 and this can show you guys what you need to be at a certain criteria. So say, for example, this is, I have 12.8 and 4.8 and I'm looking at slot two because it's at a green. And I'm like, all right, I want to get this to say, say you want to get this to an S, say you want to get this to the S, you keep sliding this until you see it turns to S. So you wanted this to be an S equipment, you found it, you need a minimum of 7.1 on slot two, on slot two for it to be um, an S. Now, if you're curious, like, okay, I'm at an S, but I want this to be at a Z, you have to keep sliding it, just keep sliding it until it's, it turns into a Z. So you see how it just turned to a Z right there? We're just going to keep sliding it backwards. Okay, is that 11.3, 11 11.4, 11. 11 point, I think it's 11 point, okay, 11.35 on this equipment is what I need in order for this equipment to be a Z with the numbers I have on my, um, on my account, on my, um, on my equipment right here so this is the uh equipment calculator and now if i'm curious to see like all right what if i want it to be a z plus uh i will have to scroll here okay 14 13.85 13.75 13.6 13 point okay let's go 13.5 okay so i would need a 13.6 on this equipment for it to be a z plus so that's the equipment calculator from legends.dbz.space and i can show you guys what number um that that certain the slot remove you're trying to work on and trying to like um re-roll for you to get a s uh at a s spot or a z spot or even a z plus spot so um legends.dbz.space and uh you can go you can it has every equipment in the game and you can like calculate it and see like which ones you need and see is it even worth re-rolling that current equipment to reach to a certain spot and stuff like that so yeah that's it for this video I showed you guys why this first slot is very, very essential. Um, I showed you guys how to get erasers, uh, slot removers and stuff, because that's going to be very, very key for re-rolling. Because not every single time you do you um, you do equipment, it's not going to automatically just turn as. Sometimes it takes days, it takes weeks, it takes months for you to keep re-rolling that certain equipment for it to be at a certain um at a certain uh um what's the name you want to be at a certain rank you want it to be at like s z and z rank and the higher you want it to be the uh, longer it might take for you guys so i showed you guys why this first slide is important i showed you guys how to get eraser slots 
I showed you guys about the equipment medals and stuff, how you can get most of the equipments in the games and um, how you can farm the equipment medals and how you can um, keep going to the same equipment, try to like get it to be a gold or a red slot and stuff like that. And then, yeah, and then I showed you guys the equipment calculator of what the, the criteria of certain equipment you have on the numbers you have on your slot and stuff. And you can like calculate it up and see which ones you need. And then not only, and only that is just really just patience. Um, it takes it's a grind, man. This this like getting these disease it took it took time and times and times. As you guys checked my um my road to Z series, it took me a long time to get some of these disease and Z plus and S, man. And um, if you guys have any more questions, let me know down below. I'm just trying to help people out in 2021. An update video, guy. I hope this one was a lot better than my previous one. And yeah, that's it for this video, man. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. It's been your boy Griff, man. And I'm out. Peace.